Yeah, I think this is uh, for me. It's a weakness. This um, is a referendum self-determination for Scottish people is very important because we are campaigning last 60 years. We have violence, the discrimination, racism going on until today. But this is the. Uh, it's an opportunity for me to witness and uh, how people of Scotland can decide their own future without any violence, without any intimidation, without any, you know, that is the main important for me to be here. And I hope one day uh, from this experience and uh, go back to West Papua and they tell Indonesia, look, this is uh, one of the democratic ways to, to, to allow people of Scotland to vote their own destiny. So it's, uh, what, I hope that happened to West Papua people. It's my language called wa 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 wa. It's a welcome. It's an honor. It's a, a special day for for me to be here Yay! with you. Solidarity with you. Yay! People of West Papua. I myself campaign self-determination referendum for 60 years, 50 years with my people. But today I'm here. The people of Scotland invite me to come to witness, witness democratically to vote for self-determination referendum for people of Scotland. This is honor for me to be witness. You campaign for a long time to, for your future as a myself and my people, the people of West Papua. We are against Indonesian colonialism from 1960 until today. We are campaigning for self-determination referendum, but my people are very difficult. But today I'm here with the no pressure and I can see it. This accounting the democratic value is a very important and the world are witnessing and that is a history, you are making history for your people. But from this place I bring the message back to, to my country that I hope that my people are witnessing as well throughout the world. Human beings making history, so are you are making history today. <laughs> history never happened themselves, but human beings making history. So you are process making history. For entire, today from here to entire world, a witness how peacefully way to choose their own destiny. So I'm here also witness. So I want to sing in this one song about freedom song for where, where I come from. I myself holding that morning star flag 15 years, Andra 15 years, 25 years in prison when you holding this morning star flag in West Papua. 25 years then I forced to live. Now I'm exiled, but I'm campaigning. I hope that today it's a very important moment for you today and tomorrow and onward. So I'm glad that I'm here. I want to sing in the one song for you and for, for you people here as well as my people. This is called Song Guayawa. One of the mother is a gay bird and his son was killed. Simply his campaigning for self-determination referendum for West Papua. He's cried this song. She, 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 she cried for song that she composed for the land, for the mother, because West Papua called the, the land is a mother. The sun is a, the one of the look after the planet. So we we have our struggle is for about our identity, our culture, our mountain, our forest, our rivers. But our rivers, our mother have been destroyed by Indonesian military. So this is composed this song. I want to sing it today for you. It's a traditional song. It's not modern modern song.
referendum today and tomorrow but one day you also come to West Papua and witness I hope Indonesia government allow my people to vote their own future like you here today what I can see is what I can see is sir we take our independence tomorrow we will come to you and show you how to take yours thank you Thank you.